Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm really excited because I am starting my Lord of the Rings inspired looks. Um, so I'm actually going to be going through each of the realms in Middle Earth and creating a look that is inspired by that realm. Um, so today I'm doing Mordor. So I'm starting out with NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Black Bean and I'm just taking an angled liner brush and mapping out the point that I wanted the um, shadow to be in. It's a pretty harsh land so uh, this look is going to reflect that for sure. After I got the shape down, I went in with a dense brush just to kind of uh, smoke out the lines and make it so that it wasn't so harsh. Next I'm going in with Crave from the Naked Basics palette. It's just a black matte shade. And I'm going in first with just a small dense brush to kind of pack on the shade onto the um, jumbo pencil that we used as a base and I'm taking that almost halfway across the lid. Next I'm going in with Faint from the same Naked Basics palette and I'm just smoking out that um, black shadow a lot. Again, it is a dirty place. This is going to be a grungy look. Then going in with the Jumbo Eye Pencil in Rust, I'm just putting that on the inner half of my eye and um, patting it out with my finger to use as a base for the next shadows. I'm going in with this dark red from the Morphe Bronzed Mocha palette and I'm Putting this on the center of my lid with a dense pencil brush just to transition the black into the red shades that we're going to be using next. I ended up going in with a larger dense brush to add in more pigment and then to take it into the crease a little bit just to kind of warm up the look. Next I'm going in with the Tarte Chrome Paint Shadow Pot in Fire Dancer and I'm using my finger to put, pat that onto the inner third or so of the eye and then blending it into the rest of the shadows that we've laid down. I'm using this Marc Jacobs Gel Eye Crayon um, Eyeliner in Black to tight line my upper lash line. So moving on to the face, I used the lightest foundation I had at my disposal and I covered my face completely. I think I put two layers on just to get it as light as possible. Then I went in to highlight my face using the Tarte Shape Tape in Fair Beige and I'm doing under my eyes, my forehead, nose, chin, all the usual places. And while I'm patting out the under eye area with my Beauty Blender, I also use the remainder to clean up the eye look. with my IT Cosmetics Bye Bye Pores. I just wanted the whole look to be pretty matte. I'm pretty sure there's no glowy skin in Mordor as I don't think you can see the sun most of the time. To finish up the under eye, I'm going to go in with that same dark red shade from the Morphe Bronzed Mocha Palette on a dense pencil brush. I'm gonna run that on my lower lash line and I'm going to smoke it out a lot. Then going back in with Crave on an angled liner brush, I'm just going to stamp that along my lower lash line. I'm going in with the NYX Faux Blacks Eyeliner in Oxblood and I'm lining my lower lash line with that. And 
and we're gonna get a little weird and we're gonna go in with a stippling brush into Crave very, very lightly because it's very pigmented. And we're gonna actually use that as the contour since I didn't have a gray contour on hand. Um, it ended up working really well. You just have to be really light-handed. It looks a little crazy now, but I wanted a sunken look and gray seems to be the best to achieve that. So I'm doing all the usual. I'm contouring my cheeks, um, my forehead, the temples, and then my nose. I'm going in with the Kat Von D Tattoo Liner in Trooper and I'm just lining my upper lash line. And then I'm using that liner to extend my inner corner to kind of create a more cat-like effect. If you've seen the movie too many times like I have, then you know that the Easterlings marching into Mordor had this kind of cat eye-like effect. I don't know if it was their armor or their actual makeup, but I was inspired by that. I'm going in with NYX Worth the Hype Mascara, and I'm just putting some mascara on before I put on a set of lashes. I went in with Azredo Cosmetics Lashes in Hollywood. They're just some really spiky lashes, and so it went well with the look. And I'm gonna apply the ColourPop Cosmetics Liquid Lipstick in Friday, which is just a matte black shade. Then I'm taking these silver flakes that I think I got off of Amazon and some glitter adhesive and I'm just going to apply some of that to the center of my lips. I wish I had had a more gunmetal shade of silver flakes just because it kind of reminds me of armor. So this is the finished look. I added a short black wig to complete the look. Please give this video a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe. And if you're a Lord of the Rings fan, leave your favorite realm down below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video.